Hello everyone, and welcome back to my Technologic channel, where I review motorcycles and ATVs. In today's video, I'm going to show you the 2023 Yamaha Raptor 700 RSE, the top-of-the-line model of Yamaha's Big Boar Sport Quad lineup. This is a beast of a machine that can handle any terrain, from sandy dunes to rocky trails. It has a powerful 686cc engine, fully adjustable suspension, and some cool features that make it stand out from the crowd. So let's get started and see what this Raptor can do. The Yamaha Raptor 700 RSE is one of the few pure sport ATVs available today, and it has been dominating the market for years. It started as the Raptor 660 in 2001, and since then it has undergone several upgrades and improvements. The latest version for 2023 has some new colors and graphics, as well as a $600 increase in MSRP. The base price for the SE model is $10,599 which is $600 more than the R model and $1,200 more than the base model. But what do you get for that extra money? Well, let me show you. The Raptor 700 RSE has some features that set it apart from the other models in the lineup. First of all, it has a dealer-installed GYTR front grab bar and heel guards, which add some protection and style to the ATV. It also has a unique graphics package that comes in two colors, gray metallic and Yamaha black. Both look sleek and aggressive on this quad. But the most important feature of the SE model is the fully adjustable suspension. Unlike the base model, which only has preload adjustable shocks, the SE model has piggyback reservoir shocks that offer threaded preload adjustment, rebound, and high slash low speed compression damping adjustment. This means you can fine-tune your suspension to suit your riding style and terrain. The suspension travel is 9.1 inches at the front and 10.1 inches at the rear, which gives you plenty of clearance and comfort. The Raptor 700 RSE is not only a good-looking ATV, but also a powerful one. It has a fuel-injected 686cc liquid-cooled engine that has a large 102mm bore, this engine delivers plenty of torque and horsepower, making it fun and easy to ride at any speed. It also has a 5-speed transmission with reverse, which is rare among ATVs these days. Most of them have a CVT or a belt drive system. But with the Raptor, you get to shift gears manually and work the clutch lever, which adds some excitement and control to your ride. The transmission is smooth and responsive, and the reverse gear is handy for getting out of tight spots. The Raptor 700 RSE also handles very well on any surface, it has a low center of gravity and a wide stance, which make it stable and agile. It can carve corners, jump hills, and slide sideways with ease. It also has dual hydraulic disc brakes at the front and a single hydraulic disc brake at the rear, which provides strong stopping power and modulation. The tires are also grippy and durable, giving you traction and confidence on any terrain. The Raptor 700 RSE is not only a fast and fun ATV, but also a comfortable one. It has a sporty but relaxed riding position that lets you move around freely on the seat. The seat itself is long and padded, offering support for your backside. The handlebar is also well positioned and easy to reach, with a smooth throttle lever that doesn't tire your thumb after a long ride. The foot pegs are serrated and large enough to accommodate different foot sizes, and they can be adjusted along with the rear brake lever and shift lever. The Raptor also has a handlebar-mounted parking brake that is convenient and easy to use. The Raptor also has dual 30-watt Krypton headlights and an LED brake light that provide good visibility and style. The Raptor is designed to be comfortable for all-day riding, whether you're cruising on the trails or ripping on the dunes. The Raptor 700 RSE is not a high-maintenance ATV, but it does require some regular care and attention to keep it running smoothly and safely. The good news is that most of the maintenance tasks are easy to do and don't require special tools or skills. For example, the engine oil filler is easy to access, and the oil filter only requires the removal of a few bolts. The oil drain bolt is also conveniently located under the belly of the ATV. The air filter is also easy to reach, but it does require removing the seat, 
unhooking the case, and loosening a wing bolt. You should clean or replace the air filter regularly, especially after riding in dusty conditions. The Raptor also has a diagnostic tool port that can help you troubleshoot any problems with the electrical system. And if you need more detailed instructions on how to service your Raptor, you can always refer to the owner's manual or the online service manual from Cyclopedia. The Raptor 700 RSE is a great ATV for anyone who loves sporty and adventurous riding. It has a powerful engine, a responsive transmission, a fully adjustable suspension, and a comfortable ergonomics. It also has some nice extras that make it look and feel more premium than the other models. It is not a cheap ATV, but it is worth the money if you want the best performance and features that Yamaha has to offer. The Raptor 700 RSE is a fun and versatile machine that can handle any challenge you throw at it. That's it for this video guys. I hope you enjoyed it and learned something new about the 2023 Yamaha Raptor 700 RSE. If you did, please give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more motorcycle and ATV reviews. And don't forget to leave a comment below and let me know what you think of this Raptor. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.